Today I'm demonstrating the straightforward installation of the VisionTech Radeon HD 7750 3M in this Supermicro Super Server Mini Tower chassis with one PCI slot. Now, it's fairly straightforward and easy if you follow along with these specific directions, given I've done this a number of times. Number one, if you already have a speaker header installed, you'll want to pop that off until a little later. It'll make it easier to align the PCI card. So that's done, and there's some sticky uh, foam tape keeping it on the um, bare chassis bottom there. Now, item two, keep in mind that you've got a screw right above the PCI back plate screw you're about to try to remove. So let's get a very long magnetic tip screwdriver right down in there, and we can take that PCI back plate out very quickly by just removing the screw. And this is where the magnetic tip will come in handy to avoid dropping that anywhere. Okay. Now with that freed up, taking any static pre uh, precautions, of course, with the GPU, that's very human where I am right now. I'm not too worried about that. What am I showing back here? I'm showing that this screw, if we back that out a few turns, but leave it in place. We now have that screw no longer protruding right where we're trying to work is we want to lower this PCI card into place. So, got the speaker header out of the way. Got the GPU where we want to carefully make sure this doesn't scratch any wire traces on the motherboard. Gently putting it where it belongs. And don't bother to clear the back plane yet for the drives. You've got to line up the bottom of the slot first. So at this point, we're just lining up the bottom of the slot. And now that that's in, we can go ahead and reattach the speaker header. Sorry, it's not really in, but it's kind of pretty well lined up. It'll be hard to show you this on video. I only have one tripod camera. The speaker header is now back in. And I've got the bottom of the PCI slot lined up. I'm not using much force, just a little bit of wiggle to try to make sure the bottom of the PCI slot is lined up. Once it is, things get very easy. There, just got easy. So now that the bottom is lined up, I'm able to clear the back plate, the back plane of these drives here, make it straight down so when I push down, it goes right into place, ready for me to fasten the screws in the back again. So as with any screw, of course, you'll want to avoid any kind of stripping the screws or cross-threading. So you'll make sure it goes in nice and easily all the way down. And it did, and it had a nice firm stop. And then of course, to finish up, tighten that down again. And we are done. The GPU is now safely and securely installed in the super server.